going to demonstrate the new iPad app for Comstocks Magazine. You'll look for your Comstocks icon, which will be loaded on with your free download from the App Store. Once you download the magazines, you'll have those available, all of the magazines available on the bookshelf. You just pick the magazine you want, and it opens up. The magazine, in this case, is the January issue we're demonstrating. You open it up to the next page, and you'll have your table of contents. You can either scroll through the magazine or pick the story you want to open up, and then it just scrolls through. When you turn to a page and see a blinking red light in the corner of a photo, that means to tap on the photo and that will bring up the photo larger with some additional information such as a caption. Then you tap on it again and it returns. If you want to scroll to a specific page, you double tap, then you scroll to the page, and in this case we're going to demonstrate one of the ads that has video built into it. For SMUD, you'll see there's a play button, and you play that. It's your energy. Clean. And if you want to see it horizontally, then it goes full screen. And then anytime you're done with it, you just tap the done button and it goes back. Pictures will pop up as well as expand so you can see all the nice detail. Looking in our October issue, you'll see some ads that just spring to life when you turn the page. The ribbon's been cut. Now officials and El Dorado County residents are anxiously awaiting tonight's grand opening of the Red Hawk Casino in Shingle Springs. In this case, this was a news story that Red Hawk Casino incorporated into their ad in the iPad version, but it wasn't that way in the magazine. So this is additional bonus content that's completely unique from for the printed magazine version of Comstocks. In this case, there's a scrolling a video slideshow of the different menu items that Henry's Steakhouse has to offer. So just another animated feature that's available. If you want to adjust the size of the font, you just double tap the page and then you'll see these gears up in the right hand corner. Those are the, that's the tools. You push the tools and then it will allow you to adjust the text size and then once you do that it shows you how the text size has been enlarged and then you confirm and it goes back to the page now even if you forget your reading glasses you have this nice large font and it just scrolls through the story. Mm -hmm. 